your boy Seth the lawn surgeon um, I'm going to look at a lawnmower I already got three running push lawnmowers and one deck extra deck but I wanted a um, all of them are either 4.5 horsepower or lower motor and I want a stronger motor the one on the new deck I built it works pretty good but when I get into some rough grass kind of bogs out a little so I'm looking for a stronger motor and this guy's selling this lawnmower so 6.75 horsepower with a bag and optional shoot multi lawnmower for 40 bucks he says it just needs a carburetor kit but it still starts up so that's a good deal to me so I was planning on thinking about possibly putting that motor on my new deck but if the deck that it's on is in pretty good shape, I'll use that deck. Uh, he said one wheel's messed up, but I mean, the mower looks like it's a couple years old. So it looks like it's probably a, a couple hundred dollar mower, or at least it's 150 at least. Brand new though. But we'll see. Yep, there she go. Troy Bill 6.75 Brazen Strat. Um, yeah, the carburetor definitely needs to be clean. It starts, but then it like chokes out, or it sounds crazy. optional shoot and it has the bag with it so and it has the big back wheel so pretty good llama but time to go cut I got a yard to cut and I gotta cut my grass when I get back so off I go so before I go out and buy a carb rebuild kit I'm gonna go ahead and uh take this carburetor apart see how dirty it is all right so I took apart so I took apart the carburetor and cleaned it but the first thing I noticed was look at this air filter this thing is hasn't been changed since the whole life of this motor so I bet your money if I go get a new air filter this thing will probably start acting like brand new but we'll see I'll get air filter tomorrow so I went and got a new air filter yesterday, but it still ran the same. And then after a little research and asked some questions, people said it might have bad gas in it. So uh, disconnected the fuel line and drained all the gas out. Um, about to take the carburetor apart a little, make sure the little pins clean or whatever, and um, see how it runs again. So. Here's the lineup. I'm about to play musical lawnmowers. This one right here, this is the new one I just bought for forty dollars with a six seven five horsepower motor. This one is the one I built. I currently use for my landscaping business. This is the one I used to use for my landscaping business, four horsepower yard machine, but currently won't start. But I think it's a spark plug. This is the one I use for my house. The one that I made, a custom switch on it. You can see right here, it's a switch. I took this off, it's an old Murray. I took it off the deck. I bought this deck from a guy for $15. Uh, 
And I love it because it's tall. If you can see, it's taller than all the rest of them. Well, except that new one I got too. I like that one. But it's taller. And so by being so tall, the wire wouldn't stretch for the brake. So what I did is I put a clamp right here to hold the wire permanently up. I put a, ran a wire from the ignition coil right here back to the switch and that's how I cut it on and off. Yeah, that's how I cut it on and off. I have a video, I'll post that later. But anyway, and that's the extra deck I had. That's the deck that this motor came off of. And that used to be self-propelled and I don't like self-propelled motors, so I'll probably gonna give it to my friend a scrap. But what I'm about to do right now is I like this deck, but I like that motor. And I think I finally got that motor running. It has some bad gas in it. So I'm taking this motor and I'm putting it on this lawnmower. And I'm taking this motor and I'm putting it on this lawnmower. And I'm going to sell this one. My co-worker at work actually wants to buy it. I'm going to sell this one. Then I'm going to figure out what's wrong with that yard machine. I'm going to sell that one. So then I'll be left with this lawnmower, this deck with that motor, and that one for cutting in my house and that one is gonna get thrown away or scrapped. Yep, so time to get to it. So I got them swapped out. Got the 6.75 on my new deck. I got this one on the newer deck, but I'm going to sell it to my co -worker. Only thing is I broke this piece for the handbrake. I had to, it wouldn't come out the hole on that one. So I had to like break it off, but it just broke the stick in the middle. So I'm gonna try to Gorilla Glue it first. So I got it drying up on the deck, so. Ah, well. First time cutting with the mower. Looking pretty good. Running good, sounding good.